This is Jamie with OSU Extension. Today we're going to go over some knife safety skills. The first thing I want to go over is what some of these knives are for. This knife is a serrated knife. These are great for slicing bread. This one is a chef's knife and you're going to use this the majority of the time. These two are both called paring knives. You're going to use those for small jobs or pairing things like the core of a strawberry or an apple. The best way to store your knives are in a chopping block if you have one. This keeps them safe and out of the way. Or if your knife comes with a shield, these are great for storing in drawers. And if you keep them in drawers, make sure you keep your knives away from everything else and in a drawer specifically for knives. When using a knife, always make sure you use a cutting board. A great tip so that your board doesn't slide while you're chopping is get a paper towel damp or several, fold them up and put them underneath your cutting board. Then your cutting board won't slide or move while you're chopping. After using a knife, never set your knife in the sink. Always set your knife next to the sink to be washed. When using a knife, never wave a knife in the air. If you have to walk with your knife, always walk with it point down. When your knife is not in use, never have the knife pointing towards you. Always keep it pointed away from you and away from the edge. To avoid what is called cross-contamination, we never want to use the same cutting board for different kinds of foods. So we don't want to cut meat and then cut vegetables or fruit or any other kind of food. So it's best to either use a separate cutting board or completely sanitize and wash your cutting board before use. When you're using a knife, you always want to make sure your eyes are focused on what you're doing. So if your knife is in use, your eyes should be down and watching what you're doing. If you have chopped food and you're ready to move the food, the knife should be down and away from you. When using a knife, always wrap your hand around the handle. Never put your finger on top of the handle. If you need more pressure, just move your hand up on the handle. Never cut towards your body. Always cut away. So when we're holding the knife, we wrap our hand around and we're going to keep the tip down on the cutting board like it's glued. And we're going to cut away. I hope you learned how to be safe in the kitchen with knives and also some new knife skills. Have fun cooking and thanks for watching.